Hey guys, I hope everybody's having a fantastic day, whether you're watching this in the morning, in the afternoon, or in the evening, I'm glad you're here. Today we've got a short unboxing, kind of first impressions of a knife sent to me to check out from Axial Gear. Um, real quickly, I just want to say thank you to the channel members, thank you, thank you, and thank you to anyone who subscribes or who comes in and checks out my knife and EDC content. I really appreciate you being here. Um, I'm going to use this Amazon unboxing knife, which is my little Razor Valley song. And I'm going to get into this. Let's see what we got. Personal info. And a box. All right, guys, this is going to kind of be a first for me, and I'm stoked to check it out. Um, and they were nice enough to send it for me to check out. Axial, as you guys might know, um, is a USA manufacturer. They have, and for a long time, been making and do make out the front knives. Um, they OEM'd the USA made pulse that John over at EMP EDC produced or designed and uh, Axial produced it. They produced the little Alpine in three blade shapes, which is an awesome, awesome USA made Magna Cut Fixie. And this is their next generation or their next iteration of their shift. So let's take a look if I can get into it without being an idiot. All right, so this is the Gen 3 shift. Um, out the front, bearing glide, delivers an astonishing smooth action. The hammer lock ensures an unparalleled level of reliability. Um, all their information out in Spring, Springville, their text, their info, their website, lifetime warranty. And this is, guys, I'm stoked. I have not, the only USA made out the front I have ever experienced was the one they made for EMP EDC. So first off, out of the gate, I love the fact that it does not have a glass breaker. It is very clean. It has nice jimping to where even though it's a clean, clean look, it feels very good in the hand. It's got a really nice clip. Deep carry clip that works very, very well. That is a great clip. Um, I don't know if that's, I'm assuming that's a steel clip. Might be, I don't know what it is, but it works very well. Um, you got nice jimping on the, the actuator here. And again, I love the smooth texture on the flats. I love the jimping and the grip where your hand goes. And I love this blade. This knife comes in four different blade shapes, right? And I struggled with the Tanto and the Warncliffe. Uh, Warncliffe's awesome, drop point's awesome, dagger, um, super, super nice blade with a swedge here, very smooth action. If you guys know, I've kind of got a short thumb. My paper's got some cat footprints on it. Sorry about that, guys. Very slicey. I love the way that that point is done. That Tanto is a compound grind. I don't know if you guys can see that, but it's thick and it's got just enough angle to be very piercy. Um, fires in and out fantastically well. Um, very sturdy. 
very little up and down, very little side to side. All out the fronts are going to have a little bit of movement there. Very little billboarding on this. All I see is the USA flag. Nice, nice acid etched stone wash type blade that just looks very good. It'll hold up very well because it won't show those marks. Let's see what size this guy's coming in at. Longer than our bug out. Shorter than our pair of two. So I'm guessing it is going to be right around seven and three quarters, a little bit over overall length. Um, and we'll do a full review on it. I'm going to carry it. I'm going to try it out. Very quiet. I don't know if y'all can hear that, but it's very smooth. It's again, very sharp too. And piercy as it can be. I don't know if you can, you really can't hear that, but that tip, the way that it's angled, is just an absolute piercer. Beautiful, beautiful knife. Nicely made. Uh, well done. These are for an out the front, a uh, very economical option for a USA made OTF knife. Um, reversible clip. So you can reverse that since it is a pretty much an ambidextrous knife. You do have a reversible clip there. That's nice. I like the swell on the underside. It's a very ergonomical, even though it's a neutral handle, it feels really good in my hand. So what I will do, guys, is I will spend some time using this knife, carrying this knife, cutting with this knife. Um, we'll compare it to some other OTFs take a look at it but yeah guys i made it in the usa by axial gear axial knives axial usa um out in utah this is the shift gen 3 again it comes in three blade shape or four blade shapes if i'm not mistaken i'll leave a link in the description this is just an unboxing and kind of first impressions i will do a more detailed review like i said we'll size it out with some other knives i'll give you kind of my my full thoughts but I'm excited to check it out. I appreciate Axial for sending it to let me check it out. And I will get back with you guys. By the way, if you happen to watch this today, which is Friday, the 26th. Tonight is Friday Night Flicks. We'll be live at 8.15 Central Time. Stay live for several hours. If anybody wants to stop by, chat, just hang out. I appreciate it. And I look forward to seeing you guys, if you do. Thank you for watching the video. Thank you for checking out my content, and please keep an eye out for the guy or gal to your left. Please keep an eye out for the guy or gal to your right. Look out for each other. Go forward with love in your hearts, and choose debate, not hate. I love y'all. Peace.